What's going on everybody? Brody here from Optic LED. Been getting a lot of questions recently asking to do a little comparison of the Slim 600S and the Slim 650S. So I'm going to run through both spec sheets on both lights and kind of hopefully help some of you out there when you're deciding between the Slim 600S and the Slim 650S. Right away, people notice the difference on the 650S between the 600S is the fact that the 650 has a triple dimmer, one for your whites, your reds, and your blues, whereas the Slim 600S only features a double dimmer, one for your whites and blues, and one for your whites and reds. The Slim 650S features 3,096 total LEDs, 2,992 of those being the 3,500 Kelvin white LEDs. 64 being the deep reds, 32 being the royal blues, and then 4 IR diodes and 4 UV diodes. The Slim 600 features 2,792 total LEDs, 2,688 of those being 3,000 and 3,500 mix Kelvin, as well as 64 deep reds and 32 royal blues. The 600 does feature less diodes and less wattage, making it a little bit more efficient than the Slim 650S. Now the Slim 650S does feature UV and IR, which can be more beneficial during the flower period. So it all comes down to your personal preference and what is a priority to you and your light. Both lights feature a mean well driver. The Slim 600S features two dimmable mean well drivers that you can dim zero to 100% either manually or with our master controller. The Slim 650S features three dimmable main well drivers, the first being the 500 watts to the white LEDs, 100 watts to the red LEDs, and 50 watts to the blue LEDs. Both lights are amazing lights for either a 4x4 or a 5x5. It comes down to personal preference and what's going to be best for you and your grow environment, so make sure to reach out to one of our salespersons or hit us up on social media to figure out what is going to be the best light for you. Also, go check out OpticLEDGrowLights.com where you can read the full specs on both of these lights. Peace out, everybody, and have a great day.